What's up guys, it's Ruge here and today I'm going to be talking to you about the piloting class and I'm joined by Snapback Fab 2s. Um, this is the new version of the piloting class I'm going to be using. So um, I think tomorrow I'll do the classic version but um, without further ado, let me show you guys just how to get the class. You join light, guard, private one. Paladin is this is just Artixis class. <clears throat> it's just like the base class in this game. Um yeah, center because the game is focused on killing and death. So what you do, you come to Lady PD State, um, in her shop, you need rank 10 warrior or warrior rare, rank 10 healer or healer rare, and then rank 5 good to get this class. This was actually one of the first tier uh, three classes. There's this, there's Doom Knight, there's Paladin Slayer, Legion Paladin, Stone Crusher, Blaze Binder. I think those are the only tier 3 classes, but this is among the names. If you want to get the classic one, if you are good and evil, um, you come here and you get it. So, that being said, let me show you guys just. Let's look at the stats of the class, sorry. 6 1 on attack and spell power, full strength and intellect, decent endurance and dex. Low wisdom and terrible luck. This man is terrible, which is by auto attacking. The first rank up passes the noble mark, endurance increased by 20%, second contemplative, crit chance increased by 15%. And this class is one of the first classes to have a rank 10 passive, and its rank 10 passive is called Ultimate Heal. It's just a strong heal over time on all of you. Um, you and your enemy, you and all your teammates in the room, sorry. So let's look at the skill of the class. Now, Paladin before its revamp was um, it was quite an average class, but ever since revamp, this class has really uh, taken its place in the pecking order of the great classes of this game. Like it's so strong right now, especially against the undead. Auto attack is just a basic auto attack, nothing special. 313 is non crit, and then that's what we get for crits. Come on, crit. You can see luck is so terrible, so like the crit chance is so low. 1.1 key crits. A two skill is called abolish 10 mana at second cold as a physical magical skill. A quick strike dealing weapon damage plus magical damage also reduces all damage taken by 7% for 10 seconds. So it applies abolish on me. Abolish is just like a tanking buff. I take less damage 7% each time it, and then it stacks up to a maximum of 70%. So um, as you can see, we are at 3 stacks, so I should take 21% less damage. Oops, I missed. Uh, oh, and it faded. But where you can see the skill does 2.4k crits, which is pretty decent. This so skill is called Healing Water. 25 mana, 6 second corner as a physical magical skill. Heals yourself and two friendly targets for a moderate amount. So, it just is quite a powerful heal, 4.8k crit, which is a full heal. Um, me and two other friends so um it costs 25 mana on cooldown so you can use this pretty often and it's very reliable your first skill is called exercise 15 mana on cooldown as a magical skill a light based range attack high damage against undead enemies hits up to three targets this skill is not light based it's very strong as you can see normally it does 4k against normal monsters but on gates undead 10k crits around this is the stable weapon with an unstable weapon it's just next level so my first skill is called blinding light 30 mana 15 second cooldown a physical magical skill deals damage to all enemies in range and applies blinded reducing enemies hit chance by 50 percent for six seconds so this is just like an exclusive skill every single monster that is within attacking range um, and you just see their hit chance if it doesn't kill them as you can see they are blinded so you can see both of them missing me there yeah so mm, that's just basically the paladin class the buff one um the buff the exercise is now very very strong as you can see one hit um if you pair this up with the blinding light against undead monsters you're going to do immense damage when i say immense i mean immense damage you see it in the solo clip by the way so yeah so um for your enhancements you want to go either hybrid or lock hybrid and lock basically do the same thing just like an even balance between attack and physical 
your boss except high rate just increases your non crit but luck increases your crit and then you obviously want to be critting so uh, i recommend luck um the solo clip is going to come after but before then if you want to use this class in pvp once you get in there you use your fire skill to reduce your enemy's hit chance then try and get some stacks of this if you're low you use this and you just keep spamming this these two be your main damage skills and always make sure you have a polished stacks so they are more of a tank so solo clip is going to come after you guys should, i expect to see immense amounts of damage this class is so unreal right now so um that was the paladin class guide till next time i've been frugal i'm out of you guys peace